Welcome back to Graveyard Keeper, and um, today we're going to try and prepare for alchemy. And they've actually just unlocked alchemy properly in the game now, so we can actually do quite a lot of alchemic related stuff. Uh, and um, yes, I've I've gone to see the witch again just to make sure that that's um, all sorted. I'm currently just doing a the regular body work. And I've, I've actually spent quite a long time since the last episode doing some grinding, focusing specifically on, well, the things that, oh actually we don't want that, do we? We want fat. I'm um, focusing on particularly what we need, and that's kind of iron parts. And because we do need a lot of complex iron parts and simple iron parts for stuff like um, our alchemy table and all that, we need to make it. We, we need to actually go through a lot of the game to actually get there. So we're going to see how far we can actually get this time. I'm just going to do that. I actually want to make sure that my graveyard is a little better. I'm going to put aside all the, like the graveyard improvements because, well, at the moment the uh, the sermon stuff is just kind of like um, it's ticking along. I'm not I'm not doing great things out of it, but. It'll do. Oh, so <laughs> I was only going to half bury it so I don't have to keep on burying bodies, but I forgot I'd actually got a better shovel now. Am I anything in there? Some more, just bung some more fat in that. So the big problem is I need to unlock a hell of a lot of technology. Uh, let's get the alchemy up. And these only appear once you've been to see the witch in the swamp. So we do need to unlock a million things. Uh, church work, but we don't actually need that. And advanced alchemy, That's we don't need that. Um, embalming table. Huh. Don't think we need that either. So really, we we only really need the beginnings of alchemy, which we've already unlocked. However, when it comes to making um, the alchemy table, and also I believe you need a furnace too to make some complex glass cones or something, you do start to need to unlock a hell of a lot of stuff here. Uh, so we'll see that as we go along, wherever it is. Well, various things. I think we might need stone carving, for instance. Um, which is very expensive. 150. But the main thing is we need to start getting more bluey stuff. Because we don't have much of that. Which is a bit of a pain. Um, I've got a lot more faith. Well, a bit more faith. I think I've got five more faiths. Um, give or take. Since last time. Uh, where are we going now? I've been very inefficient. <laughs> it has to be said. Um, I've been trying to learn the game as well as, as, well as doing research from the internets and stuff. Right. So, in fact, if we're going to do some, if we're going to do some research, we'll, we will need to keep the faith close by us. We'll need loads of stone, I think. Well, let's see what we can see. We can actually unlock a. Let's see. Let's see. We need a. Let's see what the furnace two is. Where's that? Where the bloody hell is that? Advanced smelting. There it is. So, for now, we kind of like need ten blueies. Uh, we actually do have. Hang on. Where did I put it? Here we go. I bought this from the astrono the astrologer at one point. Hang on. So this will this should have give us this cost five quid or five silver, and this should actually give us immediate twenty five of them. Yes, there we go. So we should be able to unlock this this the furnace number two. So we will definitely need that at some point. Oh, I wanted to unlock the um the uh, bloody alchemy table whilst I was at the church. But let's have a see. Let's have a look at the furnace two. That's going to require. Yeah, this is the this is the big problem. This um furnace two does require. Yeah. 14 complex iron parts. I've got like 9 or 10 in the house, so that's actually not too bad. I've also got quite a lot of iron. Um, oh, bloody hell, yeah, 11. I've been really going out of the clappers recently. Oh, so I'll need a quite a bit of this. I think, I think I've actually got loads of sim simple iron parts as well. So we'll do a bit of conversions. Uh, well, we'll do it now. Actually, let's go back here. Oh, hello. <laughs> There's a mushroom I missed earlier. I wonder how long that's been sitting there. So let's quickly nip into here. So really about the place. I now have some delicious meat ready to go. Right, so to get a um, alchemy table tier one, we do need complex glass cones. I was under the impression this was actually simple glass cones originally, but it turns out you need complex, which is why you need the furnace two, I think. Now, we don't need many complex iron parts for that, but we do need. This is the big problem. We do need um, complex glass cones, and then you've got alchemy mill and. Hand mixer, which are both part of alchemy, but they're quite cheap. But you do need a polished bricks brick of stone for the alchemy mill, which is why we need um, that stone thing that we just unlocked. It's a whole thing, put simply. So we need complex glass cones. Whilst we're down here, have I got any science? I think so. I mean, what I really want to do is let's study some blood. That was useful. Oh, it was useful. Oh, hello. 
<laughs> I got absolutely loads of blue. Yeah, I was I was under the impression though if you actually take if you study stuff that was from a body, you do get blue points. Let's try a mushy. This is really no, that's wasting my faith. And for alchemy purposes, you, what you, what you really should be doing is um, researching kind of organic material for the most part. But I think we might be getting ahead of ourselves here. I think we kind of like well, let's go and sleep. There is much to be done. I've actually got any gravestones on the go at the moment. No. I could do with studying some fat. Whilst we're here, let's do a quick study of the fat. Just because I'm here. This should give us some it. What's that again? Oh, that's a church workbench. Yeah, whatever. Fat. This should be important. This should give us some blue, hopefully. Uh, this item can be decomposed into fluid. Right, so when it comes to alchemy proper, that's going to be important. And because everything it tells you what you can deconstruct it into, um, I've been looking this up, <laughs> um, is, well, you, you put it through that the um, either the uh, the mill or the one of the other alchemy things, and you turn it into like concentrated alchemic stuff. And then you can put it on the alchemy table, the main table, and turn it into new things. But you have to experiment to see what you can actually get. Like you bring in two different things, and you see what you get. And a lot of the time it's just crap. But sometimes you strike it lucky and get things like healing potions and what have you. Which is all very nice. I wish the stone would stack better. I've actually got a burial certificate as well. Oh, I've also got some more fat. Oh, you, do, you get them back, don't you? I keep on forget, thinking you, you, it disposes of it, but it doesn't. Anyway, whatever. So obviously we have a much to be done doing today and the rest of forever, because it's going to be quite a long, long journey to alchemy. But let us not get downheartened. <laughs> Was that even English? Let's not get downheartened. Uh, right, let's have a look. In fact, let's go inside. I'm not even thinking about farming or making money at the moment. I don't want to do that. What I want is to get my... Put things away that I don't need. Right, so we need complex iron parts. Simple iron parts. We have any nails. So how many have we got? Da -da 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 -da. Da -da -da. And let's put the bail certificate in there for the time being. And the mushy. Right. So now we'll need a bit more of this nonsense. Actually, if we do a few of these, that should keep us covered. The stone is going to be a prick because we need 30 of that. We also need the pig skin paper, which we can do in the church basement. We'll need a bit more skin. I think we've got a certain amount of skin. There should be more than enough. Once you get going with this, it's not too bad. Right, so I don't have any skin down here. I have pig skin. I've got some of the pig skin there. Right. So that's enough. That's enough complex iron parts. And we've got some more stone in outside. We need to get up to 30 of them. This is getting to be a juggling act. What I've done is um, finally constructed this down here. Um, which is nice. Get rid of that. What else can I get rid of? Rusty pickaxe. Rusty axe, rusty shovel. Oh, actually, we need the rusty hammer. These are the rusty tools I'm getting rid of. You can actually sell these to the blacksmith. But you might also be able to research them as well. Not quite sure there's a huge amount of point in doing that. But it might give us some red. We need red as well as everything else. Uh, well, I'll leave it for now. Still feels like we've got a storage problem. So what do we need to do now? We need to go and make the furnace. So we need to do some more stone chopping. Can't even bother to get that. Where's stone these days? There may be an infinite source of stone somewhere. Or maybe we can just buy it, actually, thinking about it. I do need to get more coal, because I've been doing way too much firewood recently. Oh, that looks like a good source. Hmm... If you out, start to run out of wood, it looks like the forest, the swamp sorry, is a good place to get that. Actually, there's loads of stone here. And with our newfound pickaxery, this shouldn't completely knack us out. How many is that? 15, so we need... We still need something like... A, well, a few more, anyway. Let's see what we can get tonight. Before well, we need to sleep. Is that normal stone? That looks different. 
There's the infinite river sand. Sounds like a band. That's not stone. God damn it. There's actually lots, quite a lot more up there. That might be some. There's little sort of pointy outcrops. Always a surprise. Oh, hello. <laughs> that was easy. And that doesn't count as stone. What's that? Oh, it's the church. Hello, the church. Right, so I've got bucket loads of stone now. I wonder if I've actually got enough to make the furnace. I suspect I'll have to move that existing. Yes, I have. Right, let's have a go. Furnace two. Oh, and you still need to make the pigskin. Bloody hell. Okay, let's have a kip. Let's see what, d what days it... Oh, yeah. Wrong thing. Um, Let's put that in there for the time being. And... God, I've, there's so much stuff. Right, so. Pigskin paper. So we need the skin... I didn't, did I finish burying that body? Yes, I did. Hmm. That's worrying. The donkey did not deliver. Right. Should be making some more. Have I got, it? Have I got enough stuff in here? Upgrade to first. Oh, you can upgrade it in situ. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, that's, not, that's handy. Okay, I'll have to remember that. Right. So two more pigskin and we can do that. I still wonder what that ore cutter was that we built several episodes ago and then it, well, <laughs> um, I changed save so it no longer existed. So I need pig skin, I think. Did I have some in here? Aha! We've got two skins. That might be, that might work for us. We might be able to turn it on into pig skin here. Work, 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 work. All the life day long. Well, that was a lot. Blimey. Whilst I'm down here, might as well make another batch. Just in case. Right, that should upgrade the furnace then. Right, whilst I'm down here. <laughs> Again. I think I've got bugger all of real interest down here to actually do anything with. I'm hoping all this time I'm slowly building up all these gubs. But it's very expensive. Also need to improve my graveyard and the interior of the church, which all requires unlocking things, which requires a lot more time. Those red experience points, I think, seem to have been stuck there forever now. Can't really do much with that. Right. So, should be able, yeah, should be able to do it now. Oh, this is a big job. Oh, this is a big job. Oh, this is a big job. It's taking all my energy. Da 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 da! Ow, my, <laughs> my furnace got an erection. Right, so it looks exactly the same, but presumably we can now do glass. Oh. Oh, I need to unlock stuff, don't I? Uh, if we're going to do um, glass blowing, I think we've already unlocked normal glass. We need glass blowing and then we need glass blower too. So, well, let's bite the bullet. Let's do that. And we just need a few more bluey things before we're going to be able to get to complex glass cones. Hmm. Well, piss. So presumably I can now do normal glass cones. Yes, I can. I suspect you might need to do glass cones before you get to compl complex glass cones. Right, so that's done that. That's upgraded my furnace. And then so to make the um, to make the, uh, the the alchemy bench, or whatever the hell it's called, we do need to, need to do a few more things now. What else can we actually degrade or whatever to get the... We're probably, probably actually going to be able to do... Hang on, I just want the one. There we go. We should be able to deconstruct that and we should get something out of that. Um, is there anything else we can get rid of? That. Hmm. I've still got three loads of stone. And... Hmm. Feels like chicken tonight. No, not for chicken tonight. Did I... Did it use up all my stuff when I upgraded the furnace? I don't know if it did. Hmm. It must have done that because I've only got 23 now. Well, something happened. I don't know. <laughs> it didn't cost me anything. And it may have benefited me, so I'm not going to complain. This should be a donkey time. Don is it donkey time yet? 
Mm. Well, the telltale bell will let us know. So I just need this little bit of extra blue research pointage. So this should get us going. Sliced meat does not do it. Oh, bum. Let's try ash instead. Oh, no, it's green. God damn it. Actually, I might do stone. Even though that's a bit of a waste of faith in theory. Just because that's... Oh, eat some meat. Hot key. Just because that might give us loads of red. Yeah, 20 red. Not bad. Unfortunately, we didn't get any blue. Well, tomorrow we can go and... Let's see how much money I've got. I've got 790. Ooh, 790. <laughs> Shout out to Lex. Uh, tomorrow I could go and spend, spend an, um, another five silver on a blue book from the astrologer, but we may not have restocked that. I don't know how that works, necessarily. Uh, it's also a very expensive th way to do things. Well, there must be more stuff that I can... I think if I... The next dead body I see, if it ever turns up, I'll autopsy the hell out of it and get all the delicious gubs out of it. Like your intestines and your hearts. I'll bung that through the research table, and we should probably be all good. But I know what I'll do. I think today I will get rid of these. I'm not going to do any research. Um, I'm still, I'm still uncertain about that. How much faith have I got these? I've only got four faith. I mean, if apparently it's some, it costs five faith if I want to um, get on with that dungeon with the cultist in the basement and all that. Anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna flog him. Ooh, hang on. Just so I don't forget. Let's get the burial certificates. I've got oh, that's pigskin. <laughs> I wonder why I suddenly got had six burial certificates. Thought that was a bit too good to be true. Have a look at how my crops are doing. Maybe buy some seeds. Oh, the um, I haven't actually been here for ages. I actually do have some um, poo. Also, those do desperately need to be harvested. Also, there's some stone hanging out here. I'm sure, I must have got that by now. I'm so unobservant about respawning, or whether it does or not. Because I read that it things don't respawn, but I'm sure they do. Can't, there's no point in buying any seeds at the moment. I'm painfully close to actually um, um, getting to the next tiers, but none of them I really care about. Getting the innkeeper up to tier 2 to get the wine. I'm not 100% sure the wine actually completes the skull quest. I think that's a bit of a dead end though. I don't think we, we simply don't need to do any of that. It doesn't really get us any, anywhere in the alpha. For alpha it still is. Anyway, let's have a bit of a run. I'm still thinking about... I think I might definitely go to the um, astrologer today. The rusty shovel we can get rid of. The rusty pickaxe. And the rusty axe, but not the rusty hammer. Which we didn't bring with us. Because we need the rusty hammer. How much? We actually get quite a lot of. You can actually get quite a lot of cash for selling the um, ingots. Hmm. Well, I'm not going to do it now. So, no. Right, let's get back to. Well, let's go to the astrologer. Let's take a little bit of a shorty. The old shortcut There's Hemp Guy having a drag on his funny cigarette. I said, 75 years old. Mind you, the 75-year-olds probably all did it back in the day. They were good lads, although they won't stop banging on about it. Anyway, <laughs> anywho. These days, he turns up. Hooray! Right, let's see. Oh, he's twattingly not got another blue book. What a farce. Oh, did I get any ink? as well. Because I was going to give the actor the pen and ink, wasn't I, at some point. I'm not quite sure what happened to that. I don't, I don't really want to buy it if it's um. Ah, oh, sod it. We can take a risk. To the dead horse! Here, yeah, mate. Have your ink. So you just need ten papers as well. So that's the thing. And you... More cash. 12.15. So I'm keeping afloat these days. Not doing too bad. This morning, 
I think it's time to get as much gubs out of this prick as possible. So for once, for the first time ever, let's get a brain. Brain. And... Have we ever done a bone? Can't remember. Let's get some intestines. And wear them as a scarf. Or not. <laughs> I think we're actually running out of... Let's destroy the flap. Let's destroy that. There we go. Heart as well. This is the heart of darkness. Oh, I've really run out of space now. I've got a bloody maggot. I don't want a maggot. Go away. There we go. It's got no skulls at all now because <laughs> I've emptied it. This poor dead... It's a Billy Dearden. Right, let's get this in the river. I really haven't expanded my graveyard at all <laughs> over the last few... What, it must be weeks. I'm not doing the best job. <laughs> quite frankly. So this should give us absolutely mountains of research. I think I've still got enough faith. I've got four. So that should cover us. Let's go back into the basement. And prepare for alchemy. Some more. Quite a long way round to get to this. Right. Put in the brain. Jump, 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 jump. This will give us a million blue, hopefully. Could be de decomposed into fluid. Yeah, give us 30. And now the heart. Oh, and you've, how much faith do I need for that? Bloody hell. Oh, that requires loads of faith. Oh. Rampant shittery. Never mind. Let's get us an extra bit of faith. Faith, hop, and charity. And the greatest of those is hop. I'm sure that's a punchline to a, a, a long forgotten joke. Right, get rid of them. So I couldn't do that. I couldn't do any of those. God damn it. Right. It's another bloody pitiful sermon. So I can't do anything with this until I've unlocked it all, so let's just get rid of the little sermon. 50% chance again. Here are the hooded pricks. Same as before. One faith? Apparently you can build a confession box to potentially get more faith, which is handy. Meh. Dear. I'm impressing them less and less now. Which is a pity. Now go! 24 quid. 28? Oh, 28 is better than last week. Last week I only got like 24 from each of them. So, one silver 40. Hmm. Not great. Still got two faith now. <laughs> Bloody ceramic bowls. Hmm. Well, at least we can start unlocking stuff. So we can also we can do the glass blower too. So now we can do the complex glass cones. And that might be enough for something. Let's see if I can actually go and make some complex glass cones. I think I might need some quite a lot of stuff though for this. This might need more river sand. We've already found out how to make that, or find it. Right, so complex glass cones do we indeed need three, well, in this case, three glass cones and some water. To make glass cones, we need glass, and to make glass, we need river sand. Oh god, it is river sand, and water. Thankfully, those are both dead easy. But they're all very dead easy. Once you've actually got it all sorted, it's... yeah. But it's a bit late in the day to start... Um, sodding about. So let's get some water. Apparently I've already started this at some point. Let's get two lots. Use! Double use! Got 40 waters. Right. I don't think I've got any... Still haven't got any bloody firewood on me. I just feel like I should be using up my energy. Oh, this always uses up my energy. Quite a lot. Yeah, I haven't actually got any energy left to do any chopping, I don't think. I might be a little bit. Oh, another dead end! God damn it. So I'm not really... I don't really care today. I really should be trying to make money out of those things, but... See, I'm trying to do all, all ahead, both engines, for the alchemy at the moment. Oh, whatever. 
And down we go. Or do we? Yes, we do. Right, let's get the river sand. We have... Oh god, I've got a bone flapping about the place. Also some skin. Oh, some skin. Oh, skin in there. Right, I really could do with getting rid of some of this gunk. Ah, uh, it's too much stuff. Too much goddamn stuff. Put some meat in there. Put the water in there. That's fine. Yep. Yeah. Oh, some more. Some more billet in there. And some of that stone. Right. That empties things out. I should put the bone in the basement. I have a nice little basement bone. Right, to get to the river sand, we need to go back up here, don't we? I think. Yes. Yes, we do. I'll answer my own question. Well, there's the light going out. I'm not going to bother with the dead body any time. Where am I? What's this? <laughs> oh, hello. Is this the infinite stone I was talking about? Oh, it's that. I can't remember what that is, but that's some that's something else. That's not normal stone. Well, there's a beehive up there. Right. Go down here instead. There's a stone slab or something like that. Oh, there's another one on the other side. On the swamp side of things. So that's just one. Oh no, this is gonna take a while to actually get anything useful. But each time we do this we get one green. Which we can stick up our bum or whatever the hell we do with it. Unfortunately, I'm down now to eight red research points, which is not very good. At least we've got some blue spare. Um, for I think for the red stuff, if we make some gravestones, that can be handy. Apparently, you might be able to research table gravestones as well for some red. That might be worth doing. This is a sand digging day. All the live day long. All the bloody smelly pong. That you made when you fart. Whoop doop doop doo. How much do I actually need? I've got 13. God damn it. This is when you have one of those fluid bird bobbing things that you can just keep on hitting your keyboard. Although, even in this case, you don't even need that because you can just hold, just press the damn thing down. If I blue tacked the key and then went for a drink and then came back in 10 minutes. But no. I think let's just try and get. How many? A couple, more, a couple more, and we'll get 20, and that'll be a, a hard day's graft down by the river. Right, that should make us some gl complex glass cones, if nothing else does. Do, 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 do. No, it's not started yet. Do, 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 up your bum, stick it, stick it, stick it, stick it up your bum. Anyway. Most things can fit to the word, stick it up your bum, if you let them. <laughs> I've gone to bed so early today. It was a bit of a waste, but never mind. So hopefully that today we can actually get the um, all the glass sorted. I wonder if we can actually make the... We should be able to make the alchemy bench, with any luck. So. I left the water inside. Of course I left the water inside. It wasn't in there, was it? Nope. Seems strange that you can't put chests wherever, but this is not Stardew Valley. Right, so I've got to start from the beginning. Oh no! <sighs> Flippin' heck. Okay, now we need to go and get some coal. So uh, I'm, I'm not going to bother with firewood, because that's just too expensive. Or, you know, sod the body. Yep, so we need to go get across the river to get the coal, so... Yeah, but edit this out, I think. So with my new pickaxe, I managed to get a hundred coal. One hundred coals. Ooh, nice. And then my yeah, my pickaxe broke. Um, but that was good. That was very good. With my brilliant, exciting new pickaxe. And I also noticed there was actually an infinite co um, copper seam right next to it, or iron, whatever the hell it is. Little knobbly things. So that's always doable at some point. Anyway. Right, so what, what the hell am I doing? I guess I'm stoking the furnace, aren't I? Huh? <laughs> Thousand. That should keep us going for a while. Unfortunately, now the glass take is going to take forever to actually do. Um, let's finish this off because it's. 
ready to go. I can do this. Whetstone. The whetstone's starting to run out, but I have to buy yet another one. Is that still going? So is that needing to be done as well? The shovel's pretty much, I mean, it's, it's right on the, on the edge of breaking, so I may as well do that. So I need to get a little more of that. Um, digging coal gets you a little bit of that. But let's have a look. Whilst we're waiting for the glass to smelt, see if there's anything else that we desperately need. Anvil 2. I'm not sure if we need the Anvil 2. Probably not. Well, not for the time being, anyway. Um, elsewhere, we do need to, I think, do, need to do the stone carving if we're going to get something. I can't remember what it is. It's, it's not the alchemy bench. Oh, there's, there's the thing. Glass and ash. Right, so... Um, let's see, how much will we actually need here? Well, we'll, we'll get that going. We'll go and have a sleep, and we'll continue in the morning. Now, this should be it for the... This is the final simple glass cones, and then we should be able to make a complex one. I'm thinking about... Oh, God, I've already forgotten. I'm trying to make a trunk, I think, for the um, farm, just so we can put all the farm stuff there, for, finally. Completely forgot what I need for this now. No, I'll, I won't do it all now, but... I'll get some wood in, because we seem to be lacking that at the moment. Use some nice raw stuff. Got a couple of them. Burn this on. Nearly done. This bloody experience point just hanging out. Still. What day is it today? Oh, it's, um, it's Inquisition Day. It's Man Day. Right, so we can make the complex glass... Ca oh, we, need, we do actually need one more. Irritatingly. I think we need three. That's a pain in the arse. That means we have to do pretty much another big long batch of this all, so it's going to take for ages. God damn it. So I made a slight mistake. Um, apparently the the research of the, of the alchemy bench doesn't require three complex glass cones, it only requires two. So I actually had all the stuff that I needed anyway. We also need some wooden planks, admittedly, but... Yeah, I think the requirements changed at some point from three uh, simple glass things to two complex ones, so I got confused, and not for the first time. But anyway, so we need eight planks. I'm just currently making a couple of gravestones, uh, which should help us out. Oh god, I forgot just how strenuous this was. Oh bloody hell. Hang on. Uh, ate some food. There we go. Yeah, we've got some good red stuff there. So, I need eight planks. How do I make eight... How do I make planks again? I think you have to make them here, don't you? Yes. We need... How did I say eight? Can't be eight, surely. Oh, God. I have to, have to go to bed again. God damn it. Okay, so today's a big day. I've been making uh, wooden planks here. So, how many have I got? I'm not sure if it's eight, eight or six, but... I've, I've got. I've made damn sure by getting eight. Go to the flower. Go to that. Go to the river sand. So we've got the glass cones. We've got the wooden planks, and we've got. I can't remember if it's simple or complex we need, but we've got a little bit of both. Hopefully, they both need any nails. I think we're all good on that score. Quite early in the morning. Yet another body I've completely ignored. God damn it! Just trying to get to the alchemy. Oh, I've got the. Oh, I've got the gravestone spots to me. Let's give it a you. Oh, good body, that. Five white skulls. Should we improve things a bit? Just a bit. Nice. I have to fill that hole at some point. With another bod. Right, here we go. It's down here. Finally, alchemy workbench, which can go nowhere. I could upside down. That's fine. Oh, we'll put it there. So it's the alchemy mill and the hand mixer, which are the next two things. Uh, that's say fairly trivial. The hand mixer, the alchemy mill is not trivial. A polished brick of stone will require a lot more effort, and we'll do we'll sort that out next time. 
Let's be making this. Another great big effort. Ooh, nice. Take a look at that bad boy. Right, so you just have to bung two things in there, but we can't bung anything in there yet because we have to decompose stuff first. Um, I think, yeah, we're using the um, alchemy mill and the hand press, or whatever the hell it's called, um, the two things that we want to make here, the hand mixer and the alchemy mill. And we just bung organic things through there. And we'll get ingredients for our alchemy table, and we'll all be good. So we'll pick this up again in the next episode, where we will actually alchemy, finally. Cool, okay, so do um, tune in for that, uh, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.